Hey guys, I wish you a very awesome new year, happy new year. And I wish you that you will reach all your goals, that you stay healthy. And of course, that you stay true to Kotlin Android development and to my channel. First of all, for those of you who are interested in more advanced Android development courses, then I currently have a discount on my website running. So you get 25% off of all my courses. Um, so you can check out the first link in this video's description. And this discount will last for seven days, about seven days. Um, but that's it for the self promo. Let's actually get to the video. So I actually want to talk a little bit about my plans for this YouTube channel in 2021 and just how I want to structure this channel in future, um, how I how the next time will look like here, because for some of you, you already know, but um, you will have noticed that in the last time I uploaded a little bit more infrequently. And in case you didn't know, um, the reason for that is that I have some health issues with my voice, um, which limit me in recording videos and in talking very much. So that is still an issue. It gets better when I don't record. But because of that, I'm just not recording that much at the moment. And I also can't really say how long that will last. Maybe next week everything will be fine. Maybe it will take some more weeks or even months. So I will just need to give my voice some rest. And hopefully I can soon get back to my old video frequency and upload every second day. Then I get so many questions about if I can make tutorials about Jetpack Compose. Um, that is really one of the most common questions I got in the past. And yes, I will for sure do that. That is definitely on my list, but not until it is available for a stable Android Studio. So I think it doesn't make any sense to do tutorials about that right now, where you need to download Android Studio Canary, because Google really deprecates stuff on a weekly basis. And I just don't want to make tutorials right now that are deprecated in one or two weeks. That just doesn't make any sense. But I am already trying it out. I'm playing around with it and I must say I really like it. But there is still a lot of a lot of room for improvement. And I hope that improvement will happen when it is stable. So you can definitely expect me to use it in my upcoming projects in my upcoming tutorials um, when it's stable. But until then, I will stick to the old way of designing Android apps, which is with XML. And another very common question I get is, when will I make the next project based tutorial? Um, so some of you have watched my project based tutorials, I think most of you because I used to only do these types of videos in the past. So my running tracker app, news app, Spotify clone, and I totally agree with you that these are the most helpful to learn um, real development. But um, the disadvantage of those playlists is that not that many people actually follow through these. Um, I personally don't understand this because they are really the best way you can learn development. But just check the views of these playlists, like the, the first few videos um, get a lot of views because people just hype this playlist. Um, but once they see that they need to put in some work to actually make that project, the views radically decline. So just compare the first videos views with the last videos views. And you will see <laughs> how, how, how hard these views decline. And you of course, also need to understand that it's in my interest to make relevant videos that people actually watch that get many views. So because that makes my channel grow. And I just realized that the single video tutorials I currently make just perform better. And that's why I will keep sticking to them in the next time. I won't say that I will never make a project based tutorial again, I will for sure make one when Jetpack Compose is out. Um, but I won't do this, like, I won't structure my whole channel after these project based tutorials. 
like I did in the past. But of course, when it comes to paid courses on my website, there will always be project based tutorials or um, you will always find some there and I will always keep doing these um, as paid courses because I think when people are ready to invest money in their education, then it's very likely that they will actually follow through that course. But that's it already for this video. I'm very excited how 2021 will be, how this YouTube channel will evolve and grow in future. And I'm very thankful for every single one of you who is on that journey with me. So as I said, have an awesome new year and I will see you on the next video.